Well, it was the outburst heard round the world. The reforms I'm proposing would not apply to those who are here illegal. So, will illegal immigrants get health care with amnesty, and where is the transparency that President Obama promised during his run for office? We're joined by that man you didn't see but you heard, South Carolina Congressman Joe Wilson. Congressman, welcome to the couch for the first time. Well, it's an honor to be here, and I want to congratulate you all on being number one. Uh, thank you very well, thank much, Congressman. You. Well, you burst onto the scene for people outside South Carolina on a national basis when you yelled that out. You lie. You said you shouldn't have yelled it out. Right. But were you, do you regret that you, were you wrong? Well, I, I believe the issue, in fact, the U.S. Senate adopted citizenship verification uh, within 48 hours of the speech, and the White House issued a news release that they would include citizenship verification uh, on, also within 48 hours. And so uh, this is such an important issue, and that's why uh, the lack of uh, transparency, the backroom deals that are being cut today, uh, the American people need to know what's going on. So what do you make of the fact that these closed-door meetings are happening now? Does it make you nervous as to, as to the one thing that you yelled out you lie about? Does it make you nervous about illegals getting health care? Well, I, I'm really concerned for the American people. Uh, the president was correct. When he ran for president, he stated eight times uh, that this would be covered by C-SPAN. Uh, it's not being covered. And so they're not covering citizenship verification. Uh, we've got a bill that could cost, according to the National Federation of Independent Business, 1.6 million jobs. The American people need to know what's in the bill. Right. And a conference committee uh, is the proper way. You have Democrats and Republicans, you have the bill side by side, and you have a discussion on the differences. You vote on that, it should be in public. We know that the illegal immigration has slowed down because the economy has slowed down. If yes. you give word out that we're going to be giving health care coverage, families, you wouldn't be able to keep up with all this. But people, the argument is, we asked for Social Security numbers, we're going to ask for citizenship verification. So Congressman Joe Wilson's wrong. Well, actually, uh, by asking for the, uh, the Social Security number, it could be a fake number because there's not verification uh, in the bill. There are uh, over 20 pages referencing citizenship verification, but it has no teeth, it has no meaning. Uh, additionally, there's no enforcement. Uh, and so it, it truly would be, uh, Brian, as you indicated, uh, cause people to come to our country. My great concern, aside from the cost of it. Uh, it's going to be denying American citizens uh, service when they need it. Mm. Uh, we've, uh, my wife Roxanne has done a great job raising four sons. Uh, we've been to the emergency room with broken everything. Uh, and so you could easily end up in the waiting room uh, of your local emergency room and not be able to get service yeah. because there are many people there mm. who should not be there. Okay. Uh, is it true that you are and were, were an immigration attorney? Yes, I have uh, done immigration work many years ago uh, and we've got good laws. Uh, in our country, uh, Gretchen, and they're uh, just so positive, and we need to follow the laws but, but we I have. I find that fascinating, Congressman, yes. because that point was not brought up in that whole debate about what you yelled out that day, right. is the fact that you have actually worked on some of these cases. And, and, uh, and, it's, and it, if it weren't funny, but I've been to, uh, subject to extraordinary uh, verification of anything I say, which I think is good. Uh, it was 30 years ago I did immigration work, and I actually had to call um, some dear friends of mine uh, who had uh, immigrated from Canada to um, get them ready for a possible interview, uh, friends of mine from India, uh, and it, it's really uh, so I can prove that yeah. I have You're not anti-immigrant, you're no. anti-illegal, yes, and there's a process for doing it. We've Congress, got great laws. Congressman Joe Wilson, you're very well schooled in this issue, and I'm sure you're going to stay out front and center on it. Thanks for joining us on the couch. Honored to be here, and again, congratulations on uh, Fox and Friends and Fox News being number one. Thank you very Thank you, much, Congressman. Congressman. Coming up on the show, he's been called the kissing bandit, the man who breached Newark airport security to kiss yeah. His girlfriend goodbye, right?